So here's the progress of the condo remodel. This is the door going into what used to be the hallway. Now we can see there's no hallway. It goes right into the master bedroom. This is the room that used to have all the 60s wallpaper and matching draperies. And here's what our new floors will look like. So, so when we get this room finished, we're not going to use that door. That will just be locked off. So this will be the master bedroom. And then this, this door will be closed in and we will walk from the master bedroom right into the bathroom. So here we are. In the main bathroom on the condo, if you'll remember, this is the room that had all the puffins on the wall and the step-up sunken tub area. So totally gutted. So when we're done, this will be two sink vanity, a corner jetted jacuzzi tub, a steam shower unit, and a toilet with all new tile. Real pretty. Then across the hall from the bathroom is the laundry room. This is where the washer and dryer will go. And we're going to have hickory cabinets in here that we can lock and keep supplies in. And here's the furnace and hot water heater. So we've already had some plumbing work done in here. Then this is currently the doorway into the second bedroom. So what we're going to do is at that far door you see there, that's an exterior door. That's where the hallway is going to be. So we'll build a wall and then you can come in that door straight through the hallway instead of having a dog leg like what used to be there. So then there will be a door into the second bedroom. So here we are. We haven't gutted this room yet because this is kind of our headquarters. Okay. And then here's the bathroom in the second bedroom. Turn some lights on. Right now it has one sink vanity and then another door that goes into where there's a shower and the toilet. And we're pretty much not going to change this footprint, but just tear out all the fixtures and put new upgraded fixtures in and put a two sink vanity in. We're gonna take the wall out that's between the sink and the toilet. So there will be no door there. And then the door for this bedroom will be through the wall out into the hallway that we're gonna build. And then we'll go straight down the hall. And this is the big open room. This is where the former kitchen was. I have to be careful while I walk. As you can see, there was concrete under the floor. And when we pulled the flooring up, we discovered that the concrete was cracked all over. So we've already had representatives from the HOA in here looking at it, and they're going to meet next week to see what their part, what their responsibility is to getting these floors either replaced or repaired. But anyway, so our new kitchen will be here, and then in the corner there will be the dining eating area. And then we'll go around here. And we've already had gas line run. You can see up there on the ceiling, that's where the gas line comes from. So it goes out to the balcony outside. So there's a place where we can hook up a gas grill on the balcony and we're going to outfit the fireplace for gas instead of wood. 
so that will be all done. And this is the living area, which currently holds our refrigerator. <laughs> of course, that will go away when the kitchen's done. So, anyway, this is the progress. We're kind of, you know, waiting for the HOA to decide what they're going to do on the floors because we can't really start rebuilding until the floors are done. So, I'll go out here though and remind ourselves of the reason why we bought this condo in the first place, despite all the work that needed to be done. Beautiful day in Dillon. People are boating, people are kayaking, people are fishing, people are bike riding, people are walking their dogs, people are hiking. And then tonight in the amphitheater, there's a free concert, which we will go enjoy. So, life is good. We'll post another video as soon as we have some more progress to show. Bye.